Today we have mobile applications available for equipment, meter readings, work orders, service orders, time entry, and cases. These are native smartphone and tablet applications that require J.D. Edwards Apps Release 9.1. These native apps are available at no additional cost and are integrated with the mobile device features such as mapping, camera, GPS, voice to text, etc. In the first quarter of 2014, we released our first mobile applications. The ones indicated with a red arrow relate to maintenance, manage equipment, manage my work orders, quick case entry, and template meter reading. In April of 2014, we expanded our offering even more. The mobile maintenance apps in the first group with red arrows relate to capital asset management, create work order, equipment work order time entry, and review team work orders. The second group includes the case management mobile applications, and the last group includes the service management mobile applications. Let's take a look at the Create Service Order tablet application. This application was designed for the field service technician to be able to view existing service orders and create new ones. This mobile app will allow the technician to filter and view a list of service orders, create a new service order, enter notes, and attach photos. It will also allow the technician to update the status of the equipment that is associated with the service order. When the technician first logs in, a list of service orders is shown in the left panel, and the details for this first service order is shown in the panel on the right. When reviewing an existing service order, the information is displayed in two tabs, Service Order Detail and Notes. Not all of the fields available on a service order are shown. The mobile application presents a simplified view of pertinent information for the technician. As the technician selects different service orders from the list on the left, the information on the right will reflect the service order he has selected. Photos attached to the service order can be accessed in the lower right corner. Photos are available for the service order and for the equipment listed on the service order. The technician can search for a specific service order or a group of service orders by using the filter icon. Service orders can be filtered using status codes, the priority, or the order date using a date range. To add a new service order, the plus icon is used, which is near the filter icon. This brings up a blank service order form with a handful of key fields, such as service order description, the associated equipment, branch plant, failure description, customer, site, assigned to, supervisor, priority, and requested finish date. Once he touches in an inputable field, the tablet keyboard appears to facilitate data entry. He can also save and add photos. If the processing option is set to present the status update fields, a status update tab will appear where the status of the equipment can also be updated when the service order is created. Notes can also be entered in the Notes tab. So that was a quick tour of the Create Service Order tablet application.